Welcome to Rio de Valley's Eco Resort. Myself Sudipta. I am your host to this property. This is the property from the outside. As you can see, there is cottage style room across this property. Now this is the entrance. Let, let's go in. This is the main entrance to this property. It is intentionally made as a wooden structure just to kind of align to what is famous in this uh, region. You can see this is a road uh, which is completely made of stones. So it's a uh, different size stone made which is for uh, passing the cars. When the car enters, the car can straight away enter and come down along the same way. Right? So this is the first room. The second room, right? So these two are family suites. So this is having a couple of beds, couple of king size beds, and each having capacity of at least five adults. Or uh, it is very much suitable for a big family. So if you are planning to come down with your parents, your family of four to five person, this is a perfect place to kind of sit, uh, I mean, spend the day and kind of relax. Right? So this is having two king size beds and, and attached washroom. So we have th these rooms of two. Now let's go in. Now let's look at the uh, single bedroom. So these are, these are, we have five cottages. So this is cottage room number one, that is cottage room number two. So each of these rooms, it is perfect for a family, right? So if you're a husband, wife and a child or husband, wife and a child of more than 10 or less than 18 years old, this is a perfect place to come and stay. Easily three adults can stay in this room. So I have two rooms here. And it is having a nice balcony. So you can sit back with your chair and relax over here with a nice view in front. Now let's go to the other room. This is an area to kind of, it is a bridge to go to the area where we have another three cottages. Now here, we have three cottages as you can see. Similar rooms, uh, similar, everything is same. We have a king size bed where three adults or a husband, wife and child can stay comfortably. And like the last one here also you have a balcony type of area where you can sit back, enjoy and kind of relax in the evening or the daytime. So yeah, this is, this is what we have now. And now, as you can see the, on the back there is hills. So it's uh, like it gives you com a perfect balance of an urban life. As you can see, right in front of the cottages, there is a lawn. Uh, it's a perfect place. Again, we are planning a sitting area here. So there will be uh, there will be a number of sitting areas. And it's a perfect place, again, to kind of have your lunch, have your dinner, relax in the evening or in the morning time. So, yeah, again, this kind of have the entire view of the hills. I'm gonna so now again there is a similar bridge so if you come down from this road there is a similar bridge that takes you to the barbecue and bonfire place so this is this is the place where we are currently 
currently we are doing barbecue and bonfire so if you have plans to do barbecue and bonfire our staff can help you uh, to do that so as you can see from here you have a very nice view of the hills so it's very clear and i mean lush green everywhere you have a good view of the property as well uh, you have the cottages view you have the hills view on the other side of the lawn so one side there is cottages and on the other side of the lawn you have this nice view you can see on the back so often so today is a clear day there is not much cloud but on most of the days you'll be able to see clouds uh, floating around the hills uh, sitting here Delo. and there is yellow park right on on top there is yellow park and you can also see that the road that takes you to lava so yeah so this is this is overall the entire uh, view of the lawn now if you are a fan of adventure tourism we have uh, provision for tents as well so let's go down and see where we are planning that so again we are going up one level and this is the area these are a couple of areas where we are planning the tents again you will have sufficient space for uh, like three four bachelors or a family here if you like adventure this is this is right the place back side there is again uh, uh, jungle so uh, again as i said it's a perfect place to kind of come down and enjoy the rural drive and there is another tent proposed there so again both are having the view of the hill and the entire property so uh, we are going out of the property now we are going through this road which, uh, which I was explaining you little while back now we are getting down to the river. Let's go. As you can see, it's perfect uh, rural road. Uh, it's it's not plain. So just to give you kind of, I uh, intentionally kept it like this. So this is this is the main uh, this is the main way from which you will enter. Now let's go to the river. As you can see, this is the starting point. Now I'm going to the river. There you go. You can see the river flowing, lush green everywhere. Completely surrounded by hills. It's currently rainy season. It's been raining uh, quite a lot from last. Uh, a couple of days you can see the flow of the river is it is a picnic place so a lot of people come here for picnic you can see it's lush green everywhere Let's go. So 
now we have come down as I have shown you the road uh, which starts the properties. I have just came down to the river. So this is the Rally River. Right? As you can see, the weather is quite tight. It's a cloudy day. The water is very, very clean. Perfect for uh, taking bath in the river. Uh, and as you can see, it's lush green everywhere. Uh, this is called Rally River, just beside my property. Thank you. road just which goes beyond the, the property and goes towards uh, a place called Pala which is around 600 meters up from here and on the right uh, you can see there is a, a natural swimming pool it's like it, it's the beauty of the nature it's automatically created and after some time people will start uh, coming in here to take bath and swim etc so yeah, uh, lovely view from here overall and as you can see already, so there is shipping, uh, I mean already people are coming down for fishing here, so started coming in for fishing here as well. We can see our dear friend, what's your name? Jinlok. Jinlok. He has come down for fishing here. So how, how often do you come here? Uh, it depends, like, it depends on, on season. Basically, like, during the onset of monsoon when the river yeah. is yeah. quite good. Yeah. Because uh, during the summer, like in the peak summers, yeah. the river is too small. Okay. okay. And you, as you see, as you can see, a lot of construction work going on. Okay. Where you work going on. Okay. There is a lot of disturbance to the river. Okay. okay. So, like, I come depending on the season. And, like, yeah. I would, you know, the weather is pretty good. Pretty good, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's a cloudy day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. 